Whether you're a professional with an established career or a job seeker looking for work, then you already know that there are an endless number of resources online for you to choose from. Instead of showing you the mainstream websites most people know about, I will share with you 10 lesser known websites we've personally used, offering the tools and resources that can help you in your professional life. And we're starting right now. First up is 50 Ways to Get a Job, which is based on the book of the same name. On this interactive website, select the block that best describes your situation. If you're just beginning your job search, select Starting. It's best to complete these exercises in order. Inside of each exercise, you'll get useful advice along with tasks that will help you to find your path and purpose. Back on their homepage, the most beneficial advice that might surprise some people can be found in the Applying for Jobs module. Go to a job board and then leave. With the aggressive marketing tactics from the job board sites like CareerBuilder, Indeed, Monster, and many others, most people think that using a job board is a great way to find work. It's not. Only about 3% of all jobs are found by using a job board. In most cases, it's about who you know, not what you know, that will get you hired. Payscale is a valuable resource for finding your worth when negotiating a salary or asking for a raise. To begin, select Get Your Pay Report. Here you have the choice to select salary information for your current job, a job offer you're evaluating, or just exploring for a job that's not your own. In this example, I'll select Current Job. For this page and those that follow, just fill in your information. When you're done, it will display a report showing your current pay, your difference from median, your market worth over time, and other information that will help to determine how much you should be getting paid. Invoice Generator is an awesome web tool for creating simple client invoices. It's 100% free with no limits which I highly recommend for those of you that are independent contractors, freelancers, or running a small business where you need an easy way to create the occasional invoice. After you've filled in the information, the invoice can be sent and paid online or downloaded to your computer as a PDF. Blind is a cool social network used by employees at many of the top companies, including Microsoft, Amazon, Google, Apple, Uber, and many others. On this site, you're completely anonymous, so you can ask questions you'd never ask in real life, complain about your job, and get advice from professionals in your field. On the Key Values website, they provide a useful resource that might help you out when being interviewed for a job. During that moment of the interview, when you're asked if you have any questions, the site will generate a list of questions you can ask while being interviewed. In the first step, Select what is important to you when deciding to work for a company. When you're done making your selections, scroll down and click on See Results. Now you'll see a list of questions that might be relevant for you to ask in your job interview. Just like Payscale mentioned earlier, Get Raised is another site to check out to see if you're being underpaid to know if it's the right time to ask for a raise. Click on Get Started. First, enter your job title. On this page and those that follow, the information you enter will auto-populate in the raise request form listed below. After you have completed entering your information on each page, it will let you know if you're being underpaid and whether or not you should ask for a raise at this time. This will be a quick one. Power Searching with Google offers self-paced courses that will teach you tips and tricks to help you succeed at work when using Google Search. If you use DuckDuckGo, Bing, or any other search engine, some of these tips might be beneficial for you as well. Meetup is a great site for expanding your network and connecting with other people that share your same interests. While many of the events are free, some of the meetups do cost money. Many years ago, Meetup was completely free. If you want to become an organizer of events, the starting costs are now $30 per month. Quartz at Work is full of interesting articles that will teach you how to navigate your career, improve your management skills, and help you deal with other workplace issues. They also feature comprehensive work guides with advice from experts. I have a general rule of not recommending job boards. We work remotely is an exception. 
It's a great site to find jobs that let you work from home. They offer several categories, including customer support, programming, sales and marketing, and many others. Here's a bonus site for you to check out called Should I Work For Free? I won't say much about it. Just start in the middle and work your way to the answer. It's actually really funny. Thanks for watching. All links are in the description. If this video was useful for you, give it a like and share with others. If you know of a website that might be helpful for others in their career, let us know about it in the comments. And if you haven't done so already, subscribe and hit the bell icon to be notified of more useful websites and other tech-related stuff from Tech Gumbo.